uh, change your characters, the characters you found in the script? What did you add? From what was in the script? Yeah. I, I didn't feel like I changed him. I felt like I went with what, what, what I found in the script, yes. Yeah, no, absolutely. Everything was in, in, in the case file. That it, it, it was right there. So it was just a question of mining the, and refining where we were in the investigation. And what did you mine? What did you find? Um, well, I mean, a really basic um, ex um, example was uh, Nick wrote Forrest. The book was before there was a real Forrest. Nick adapted. I looked at it and said, that's the old lady from Tweety Pie. And Nick was like, no, no, it's not. I was like, trust me, it is. <laughs> <laughs> then I played that and was like, oh, okay, I see it. I see it works. You know. But Tweety Pie, like I thought I saw a pussycat, that Tweety Pie. The old lady who owns the, the bird. <gasps> yeah, so like he's, I mean, that's a symbolic in. Uh, so that sounds really wanky, right? But listen, what I mean to say is that there's an old woman in Forest. There's an old lady, a maternal, a female, because there's no mother figure. Head of the family. Right, but a head of the family, but not a patriarch. He's a maternal figure, and he's the middle brother as well. So he's seen his older brother go to the First World War. He survived Spanish flu, so he shouldn't really be here. You know, the immortal thing is, you know, he lost his, fa his father, his sister and his mother early. You know, his younger brother, he had to look after while his brother was at war. So when he came back, his brother was damaged. He had to look after the family and protect them, feed them, clean up the place, you know. This is a very uh, violent film, or at least had some very violent scenes. But do they feel as violent if you uh, are on the set? When what? shooting them? Were they violent? No, yeah. not shooting, more like... Fisting, uh, fisting is sorry. Fisting. Maybe it might be the wrong. I think I that's, mean, that is the wrong. <laughs> that is the wrong. It's definitely a wrong. No, it's never as violent shooting them of course, as, no, but as, as, uh, as watching them. Um, but uh, but you're, you know what you're aiming for. So you know what you're aiming for as far as uh, the effect of the violence. And particularly, you know, when you work with Nick and John and the way in which they view violence, which is the way that most of us probably actually react to violence, which is to be scared of it and, and be horrified by it. So, you know, you know what, what you're getting into. And you, it's exciting because you know they're going to honour it. You know, I've worked on things before where you're trying to do the same thing and you realise that there's a sort of a bit of a veneer over it or it's gratuitous or whatever. And you senseless, totally. Senseless, yeah. and you think, oh, okay, this doesn't feel like it's being respected the way that it should be. It's Whereas, relentless in this film at times. It is relentless, yeah. It can be, you know, and close. It's very close uh, and anxious it, making. And, and it sort of increases as the film goes on to a certain degree, you know. But you it feel like it's going to increase. As the it film. reflects yeah. the harsh world that within these... With where they live, it's the Wild West for them.